previously on Chucky. Hold on, Gary. I gotta make a phone call. Hello? Is Tamara home? Who? Tamara. Uh, I think you got the wrong number. I don't think I have the wrong number. Are you sure? Yeah. I know you're at your house, Jake. <laughs> how, how do you know my name? Is this supposed to be a Scream reference? <laughs> maybe, maybe not. <laughs> okay, well, stop bothering me because you're kind of scaring me. Oh, am I? All right, who are you? Tell me who you are. I'm not going to tell you, and you probably do know who I am. All right, well, I don't. Are you sure about that, Jake? How do you know my name? Because we met before, haven't we? Are you Chucky? <laughs> This will help you, Caroline, since you don't like the Chucky doll, but this could. I got a doll right over here, and uh, I will tell you her name. This is Belle. Of course she is a doll. She is incredibly rare. The house will explode in five, four, three, two, one. No! Are you? Hello, everyone. My name is Sister Ruth. You have arrived at Incarnate Lord. Uh, okay. I will show you around the school. Are you guys ready to go inside the school? Uh, I guess so. All right. Let's not waste any time. Father Bryce really wants to see us so bad. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Follow me. On delay, on delay. Follow me. What a weird nun. I know, right? Follow me, you kids. Okay, we're coming. Yep, we're coming. We're coming. Okay. Looks like we're going. Looks like we are going. What a dream, what a dream. Ah. Ah, it feels so amazing being Tiffany Valentine. Wait a minute. Oh my god. What the heck? Why is there blood on my hands? Ah, 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 oh my god, oh my god, is that a Tiffany doll head? Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! A couple minutes later. Alright, got the breakfast for Nika. 
Okay. Open up her door. Got the food. Good morning, sweet face. Rise and shine. What was that screaming? Oh, I'm sorry, Nika. I'm so sorry that I disturbed you. Here you go. Have some breakfast. Breakfast? For me? Yeah, for you. You deserve to have some breakfast now. Eat up. I can't eat up. You chopped off my arms and legs, you lunatic. Nika, I've been through this before. I cut off Chucky's arms and legs so he would never escape. Oh, yeah? Well, it sounds like you cut off my own legs and arms, so why don't you just leave this weird room? I made this room, and we will live here forever like a family. No! No, eat some breakfast. Here you go, Nika. T breakfast tastes really good. I know you. I know it does, right? I just want to get out of here and live a normal life. I just don't want you to torture me forever. Ah, well, I got to torture you, Nika. Whatever you like it or not. Please, I need you to get out of here. I just need to get out of here now. I just can't stand being here forever. Well, I think you can stand being here. If you can stand being with Chucky, I bet you can stand being here forever. Now, Nika, I need to speak to Chucky. All right, let me get some blood on my hand. Now, look at the blood. No! Oh! 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 Oh, hi, Tiff. Oh, Chucky. What the hell is this? <laughs> you gave me a Tiffany head. How dare you? What the? Why did you have to give me a Tiffany head? Because it was from, well, the head got shot off. I mean, shot off. That Tiffany head. Oh, yeah, Chucky. Now, where are those kids? I don't know what you're talking about. Jake, Devin, and Lexi. Oh. Them? They're Yukarnet Lord. They just got there. Oh, yeah? <laughs> you know, you're not gonna win, doll. Of what you've done to me. <laughs> oh, be quiet, Chucky. I'm gonna see you all rotting in the ground. I can't believe we have to be at Yukarnet Lord. Yeah, me too. I, I know. This is Father Bryce. Well, good afternoon, young folks. Welcome to our school, Incarnate Lord. My name is Father Bryce. And of course, my name is Sister Roof. My name is Sister Catherine. I'm the dean. I, I don't work here. I'm just a student here. Well, will you please be quiet, young lady? Sorry. While the staff talks. I'm sorry, Father Bryce. Well, I'll see you later in my office. We'll talk about this. Talk about what? What have I done to you? Uh, back talking. I can bring her to your office. Yes. Very well, Sister Ruth. We'll take care of it later. You're welcome. Let's uh, welcome our new students. So, I heard you guys have been in trouble lately. Well, I guess that is true. I guess so. Well, let me make one thing clear. Here at our school, I will not allow any kind of disobedience. So, if you young fellows want to find the Lord and make peace with yourselves again, you better listen to me. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm sorry. I forgot to in introduce myself, Fodder. Uh, who might you be? You remember me, Sister Elizabeth, oh. the, the old nun. Yes, hi, sister. Uh, well, you are so old, I haven't seen you in so long. That's why I forgot your name. Oh, well, please forgive me, Father. Uh, that's okay, don't worry about it. I'll be right over here yes, with yes. Sister Ruth and Catherine. Yes. Sister uh, Catherine, not Catherine. Okay, okay, I get it. Uh, take it easy. I know you have a weak heart. Wait, so this... All right, so let me get this straight. Your name is Father Bryce. Uh -huh. Your name is Father... Ru I mean, Sister Ruth, correct? Your name is Sister Elizabeth. Yes. And your name is Sister Catherine. And you're Nadine. I'm Nadine. I wish we could share rooms together. I think we will. In fact, you guys could. All right, so why, or wh why do we have to be here again? Well, as I said, you folks have been in trouble lately. And you are here... To find back your way to the righteous path of peace and goodness. So, if any of you acts up... Especially me? Not you, sister. Okay. I'm talking to the kids. I'm sorry. Darn I'm it. sorry, okay? <sighs> oh, my eyes are not showing. Okay, okay, can we cut the short? I need a drink, darn it. Sure, fodder. Here's a drink. Why would you knock me over? All right, fodder. Here's your drink. Thank you. Tastes good? That's better. Oh, that's I think good. we should show the kids to their rooms. Was that holy water you gave me? Oh. Yes, that was holy water. <laughs> it burns! It burns! Oh. You're not a demon, are you? Just joking. You're not the devil, so why are you doing that? Just joking. Oh, okay. Anywho. Why, Why do I you... always knock over? Maybe I'm too old. Yes, you are. I'm just nervous. I just don't want to get a heart attack at all. Well, why don't you, sisters, show these young fellows to their rooms? No, why don't you show the boys to their rooms, and I'll show Lexi to their room. Okay, that works. All right. You boys, come on with Father Bryce, okay? Let's go. Okay, Father Bryce, let's go. All right, I'm coming to... And I will take you, Nadine, and you, Lexi. We're going to be great partners, aren't we? Are, are we, Lexi? Are we going to be great partners? She's a little bit talkative. She always talks a lot. And she kind of wets the bed a couple of weeks. What? Yeah, she wets the bed. Okay, come on, you guys. We need to go to your room. Now, come on, Lexi. Okay. Come on, Nadine. I'm so excited! Yeah! Why do you always have to be on the floor, Sister Elizabeth? Sorry, I'm just so old. I'm just gonna go inside my room. Alright, I'll go inside my room, too. I'll go inside my room. Gentlemen, this is gonna be your room. And we have a few very simple rules here. And what are those rules? Okay. No loud music. Got it. No girls allowed. Wait, what? No girls allowed in your room. Fine. I mean, maybe there will be girls. Okay, whatever. What's the next question? I mean, the next answer? No cell phones, no computers, no Wi-Fi. I actually do have cell phones. Well, you can surrender that right now. All right. Uh... Go on, give it up. Mm. Here you go. Thank as you. long as no one takes a selfie of me, I would be fine. Uh, I have a phone, too. Okay, you go. Wait a minute. I also have a wallet. I also have a piggy bank. I also have a telephone from the olden days. I also have a refrigerator, a small refrigerator. I also have a fork and a knife and a scalpel. I also have beat bop music. I also have pop music. I also have my headphones. I have my podcast, I have my rope, I have my sunglasses, and I also have my very own toothbrush. That's all. Okay, thank you. How did you get all this stuff in here? How did you get past security like this? Well, it was in my pocket. Yeah. You have security? Do we have security? Uh, well, the sisters are your security. Okay, I think I have to work on that. Wait, is there another fodder here? Yeah, but... Father O'Malley, he's, you know, he's so old, he really has nothing. nothing Wait, what does Father O'Malley do? Does he, 
Oh, I saw Father O'Malley. I think I saw Father O'Malley. I think he was talking to Nadine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't, don't I think they planned on making a confession in the room, Father O'Malley and Nadine. Yeah, yeah. He does that all the time. He's really into that kind of stuff. Oh, but, and he always says, I think I heard him say, yes, my child. Yes, yes, my child. But anywho, what I'm trying to say is, don't mind him any attention. I'm the boss here, okay? So, so you're the you're the main boss here. Yes, I am. You're the head leader of this whole entire school, I and sure you am. are the boss. Yes, I am. The boss of everything at the school. What do you not understand about the boss? Okay, sorry. Who's the second boss? Is it Sister Ruth? No, she's crazy. Sister Catherine. Yeah, yeah, I like her better anyway. Oh, do you work with Sister, sister Catherine? Yeah, sometimes. All right, can we go on our rooms now? Oh, wait. We, we are in your room, darn it. Well, can you leave, please? Excuse me, I'm not done yet with my speech. Then what do you want to ask me? Well, I was just telling you the rules. So, none of these worldly possessions. The only thing you're allowed to have in here is a holy Bible, and that's it. That's it? That's it. Did yeah. you get any dolls or anything here? No dolls allowed. Well, sometimes we get donations for those. You know, all those orphans. Oh, okay. That's none of your concern. So, if you're bored, you can read in the Bible. There's no TV, no internet, no nothing. Okay? Any questions? Um, I think we are good, Father Bryce. Okay, have fun. I'll see you for evening mass. Wait, what is that, evening mass? Well, we gather in the church, and I tell you things... That you need to know and to learn in order to become better people. Okay, fine. Wait, when is this happening? At um, 5.30. Okay, I'll remember that. Um, All right, see you at 5.30. Okay. You better behave. Okay, we will. All right, well, I guess we're just going to relax in our rooms, apparently. Ha! Ah, I can't believe it. The guy said no electronics and stuff. How did you have all those stuff in your pocket? Hey, I do. All right, well, that is really crazy. I know, but, uh, well, I just hide stuff in my, uh, pockets sometimes. Isn't that like a fee for something? No, I just collect things. Oh, I see. I see. Yay! I can't believe it. I got a new roommate now. Well, that's good. I haven't wet the bed in weeks. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna stay over here for a little bit. Okay, I'm just going to read the Holy Bible. Is that all you do in life, Nadine? Yeah, that's what I do. Is that okay? You got a problem with that, Lexi? No, I'm just going to relax and probably sleep here. All right, I'll read the Holy Bible. Alone. Just all alone. Completely completely alone. All right, Sister Elizabeth, we received a new donation. And what is that? It is a good guy doll. A good guy doll. Can he talk? Yes, he can. Hi, I'm Chucky. Want to play? He seems pretty good. I mean, I think he'll be my friend since I'm literally elderly. I know you're elderly, Sister I forgot your name, you're so elderly. Sister, oh yeah, Sister Elizabeth. Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, I'm just gonna hang out here. And could you leave my room, please? Uh, sure, I'll just, uh, I'll leave your room. See you soon, sister. Yep, see you soon, sister. Just gotta write my paper down. <sighs> this is so boring. I hate doing this. Hi, I'm Chucky. Wanna play? Not really. Now, just gotta do my weird paper. I hate this, but I'll do it. <laughs> what was that noise? Must have been the wind. Ah, just relaxing. Just relaxing. Boo! <laughs> Stay back! Stay back! <laughs> Just looking at me is scary enough to give you a heart attack? 
Oh my god, you made my day! <sighs> Stay back! I have the cross! Oh yeah? <laughs> what am I, a holy god or something? <laughs> you got nothing. Oh, the cross, I get it. That means vampires, right? Oh my god, stay back. I could act like a vampire. <laughs> stay back, you ugly doll. Hi, I'm Chucky. Wanna pray? I got a heart attack. <laughs> Taking a selfie. Say cheese. Cha ching Five. Ferdy. Okay, Father Bryce, we're all here for this evening thing. Uh, it's called the evening mess. And now everybody... Okay, we get it, Father Bryce. Can we just get into this? Yes. Shush now. I'm talking. So Father, you Father, you don't have to be so mean. Well, I'm just saying, I'm the boss. So, anywho, welcome to evening mess, my children. Have a blessed evening. Now, we're gonna keep this short. Because I'm hungry, and we had, none of us had had dinner yet, and I don't know why they You're schedule, always hungry, Father Bryce! I don't know why they schedule this before dinner. It makes no sense at all, but anyway. May the Lord bless our sister. Do Paul. we have to know this? Shut up! Talking, listen. May the Lord bless our sister soul, Sister Liz has... Surprise. Sister Sister Elizabeth, not Sister Liz. <sighs> Liz, Elizabeth, it's all the same anyway. So what about Sister Elizabeth? The Lord has called her home tonight. She has surprisingly passed away by a heart attack. Oh, big surprise. She's been really old and sick. But anyway, she's gone. Father and... Bryce, it doesn't sound... Oh, sorry. Father Bryce, it doesn't sound like you care for her. People, I care for everybody. I'm a priest, okay? Well, you better care for everybody. Yeah, this is what this church is for. Can you all please stop back talking? You're driving me crazy. I'm not back talking. Me too. <sighs> anyway, so she's gone. The Lord has called her home. May he bless her soul and give her eternal rest. And, um, yes, so, peace be with you all. And now, let's have a blessed dinner, and after that, everybody to your rooms, and I don't want to hear one sound of your rooms, okay? Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it! Okay, nighty yo, everybody. The fodder is, the fodder is kind of weird sometimes. I know, I deal with it a lot. Yeah, so uh, it looks like we're going to have dinner. So, uh, yeah, I think we're all going to have some dinner! Isn't this fun, Nika? No, it's sad just watching old Jennifer Tilly movies, and you're not even Jennifer Tilly. I know. I know who I am. I know I'm Tiffany. That's the thing. I need to get out of this house. Go get a job, Tiffany. Don't stand here and just be in this house. I mean, you kept me prisoner for over here for over a year. I'm getting way tired of this, Tiffany. So, Eater, you snap this... I mean, you just... Ah, just... I want to get out of this house now. Oh, you want to get out of this house so you can leave. You just want to escape. How the heck am I going to escape? I have no arms and legs. Oh, I didn't think of that. Well, you should have because you cut them off. Oh, well, Nika, I'm going to have my twins, Glenn and Glenda, to come over here. It's going to be such a blast to see them. But they're going to come over here. Uh, well, tomorrow they'll come over here. and I'll make them a special birthday cake. Can I at least have the birthday cake? No, 
you don't eat birthday cake. I mean, well, you don't, you're not gonna have birthday cake, but I love birthday cakes. They're my favorite. Well, you're not getting it, Nika. <laughs> well, they will be here tomorrow. Wait, what the heck was that? Oh, the doorbell. No, that can't be Glenn and Glenda. They're coming tomorrow. That was the front door. How did they get past the gate? Well, they probably climbed over it. Uh, I need to answer it. Wait a minute. Help! Help me! Help me! Time to pass you out, Nika, with this. Oh, no! No! Oh! I'm passed out. Oh! All right. Now, who's at my front door? Who is it? Okay, okay. Now, who's at my front door? Let me open it. Wait, who are you? Hello, my name is Detective Frank. I am looking for a person. Wait a minute. Are you Jennifer Tilly? No, no, my name is Tiffany Valentine. I am inside of Jennifer Tilly's body. Now, where is Jennifer Tilly? It's none of your business. Now, what do you want from me? I am looking for a particular person. Her name is, uh... Have you ever heard of? No. No. Tiffany, have you ever heard of? No. 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 Tiffany, have you ever heard of Nika Pierce? Oh, yes! I did! She was at that hospital. It was like a couple months ago. I forgot. Four weeks ago? Who knows? She was at that mental hospital. Where that murder was, yes. Oh, okay. You know what? I'm, I'm just going to leave. I'm going to call the cops for you invading my space. No, I'm a detective. I work for the cops. Well, I got to go. Bye! Uh, that was weird. Awkward. Awkward. All right, we are walking to our rooms. We are walking. Oh, no. Trevor. Who's Trevor? He is the school bully. Hi, Trevor. My name is Lexi. Oh, no. Why would you say his name? Why would you... T Ugh. Why would you say your name to him? He's a bully. Oh, maybe I should have never said Trevor's name. I mean, my name to Trevor. Oh, no. Hello, guys. My name is Trevor. I am the Incarnate Lord School Bully. And I'll always be. Trevor, get back in your room right now. Okay, okay, okay. Fine, Sister Roof. Fine, fine, fine. Ugh. And you, too, Nadine and Lexi, go back to your rooms. Right away, Sister Roof. Yeah, we're coming. We're, I mean, we're going in our rooms. Finally, they're going in their rooms. Finally, finally, finally. Sister Roof, what's going on here? Nothing to know, Sister Catherine. Oh, fine. I was just making sure everything was good. So, uh, are Lexi and the Dean okay? Yeah, they're okay. They were, there was just this bully, Trevor, of course, just bumping into them. Well, I guess we don't have to worry about them. <laughs> Whatever. Well, I gotta go in my room. So, uh, yeah, I'm going in my room right now. I'm going in my room. Okay, well, uh, I gotta go in my room, too, because I gotta do lots of business. Because if I don't go in my room, Father Bryce might be a little mad, because he is the boss of the school. But I am the second boss of the school, so, uh, yeah, well, uh, I'm gonna go in my room. Oh, man. So what am I gonna do when I'm in my room? Hmm, I have no idea. Well... Well, okay, I'm going in my room now. I am going inside 
my room. Uh, I'm in Fodder Bryce's room. Oh my god! <laughs> nice to finally see you again, Jake. <laughs> I got your special phone. Oh my god, not my phone. Say cheese. Say Chuck E. Cheese. Cha-ching! Yo, you just took a picture of me! No! <laughs> see you soon, sucker. <laughs> no! He just took a picture of me. No! Oh, no. Fodder Bryce. What? Are you doing in my office? Boy? Uh, well, I was trying to find Chucky, and then he took a picture of me. You mean that doll that came in? Yes. Did amazing? he kill Sister Elizabeth by a heart attack? Don't talk nonsense. It's just a toy doll. It's just a donation. Why does no one believe me? He's real. <sighs> He's a real toy. He's now, a real alive doll. Okay, boy. You are more screwed up than I ever thought. I will make you do a confession so you can clear your I'm not soul. doing no ugly confession. Yes, you are. You are doing as I say. And I'm, not doing, I'm, not, my office. I'm not doing no stupid confession. Watch your language, young man. You watch now, your mouth. Okay. You go back to your room. You are grounded. You are under personal lockdown. Why do you have to be mean to me? Because you are out of control, young man. You break into my office and you talk about a toy being possessed. Well, he is possessed. Don't you? The have you ever heard of the Lake Short Strangler, Charles Lee Ray? He is in this doll. And there are thousands of Chucky dolls in the world right now. And do you believe me now? No, I don't. Charles Lee Ray's soul is rotting in hell. Charles Lee Ray is dead. And he will never come back. He's Can dead I... as a human, but he is alive as a doll. You are crazy. Get out of my sight, young man. Get out of my office now. I'm not getting out if you believe me that this doll is real. Hang on. Where's my taser? No! No! <laughs> Maybe you should use it on Chucky. No such thing as Chucky. Do you? There is such thing. It's a toy. Well, if you see him, you have to believe me. Get out of here. Fine. You're grounded. Why? For how many? How many hours? Five days. Five. Five days. Solitary confinement. No, no. contact with the other students. I don't care. I do what I want in the school. <laughs> if you're the boss or not, I don't care. Let's You're just a stupid boss that works in this weird school. I don't just work here. I am a co-founder of this school. This is my school and my rules. So you go to your office. Well, you don't have to be mean to me. I don't even have an office. I have a room. So they never gave you an office? No. Oh, wait. This is my office. Get out of here. Fine. I'll get out of here. But he's going to kill you. He'll kill everyone. He'll get us all. He'll get us all. These kids nowadays. Unbelievable. You have to believe me. Are you okay, Jake? Yeah, well, not really. Fodder Bryce was being a little bit too rude to me. He said, get out of my office, and he tried to get me with a taser, and that felt so bad. Trust me, it feels, it hurts. Oh, man. Did you see the Chucky doll? Yes, I did. He took a selfie of me. It, I don't know if he wants to take a selfie of everyone. Well, what are we going to do now? We got to try to kill this Chucky doll. That's what we got to do. We have to kill all these Chucky dolls. How are we going to do that? I don't know. We have to think of an idea. We have to figure out a way. We have to bring Lexi and the Dean to figure this all out. And I don't feel like we should do this right now because I am so tired. Okay. Well, it is almost midnight. I know, right? Oh, man. I just hope nothing bad ever happens to us ever again.
Don't worry, Jake. I'm right by your side. Thank you, Devin. You're welcome. Any time, Jake. Any time. Any time. Mid night. Hopefully, Chucky doesn't go in our room. Who's Chucky? You don't want to know, Nadine. Now, I gotta put this drawer near the door. Ugh. Why would we put a drawer near a door? You want to live, don't you? I mean, yeah, but... Is that really true, a live doll named Chucky? Just... Believe me, Nadine. Please? Fine. Whatever you say, Lexi. Whatever you say. Alright, I'm going to bed right now. Yeah, me too. I'm going to bed here. <laughs> what was that noise? Oh my god. Huh, what is it, Lexi? Chucky's here. I don't see him. Oh my god. Hi, you girls. <laughs> Nadine, be quiet. You're going to wake up everybody. <laughs> Catch you real soon. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that one was real. Don't worry, Nadine. You're going to be fine. You're going to be fine. You sure? Yes, you'll be fine. Oh my god, this doll's too scary! What in the world is all this ruckus in here? What is happening, you guys? Yeah, what is happening? I checked to make sure you guys were okay. Are you guys okay? You won't believe this. There's this doll named Chucky and he's alive. He scared me and I screamed. That crazy talk again. The doll is not alive. He is it's alive. Just a toy. He is alive. Why don't you not believe us? A doll is alive? I don't believe it. I just don't believe it. Do you not believe it, Fodder? I do not believe because it. Because I don't believe it. No, I don't believe it. And this talk of a possessed doll in my school is unruly and unholy. And I will not allow it anymore. I'm, I'm, I'm just too scared of this doll. I'm just scared. Please believe me, Father Bryce. Please. I'm scared. I'm scared. S snap out of it. No, stop. Why would you snap the Dean? She didn't do anything wrong. I didn't do anything wrong. It was that doll, Chucky. Stop the crazy talk. She wasn't crazy talking. It was real. Don't you understand, Father Bryce? Sister, get rid of that doll. Throw in the garbage. I will not have this crazy talk anymore. Which one of us? Uh, Sister Ruth. Okay. Uh, where's the doll? I don't know. You want me- You are expecting me to find him? Uh, just check in my office. I'll check in your office. Uh, I'll check in the bathroom. Yeah, we'll check in the bathroom. Let's go, Devin. Wah! It looks like they're going in the bathroom. Crazy talk. Take it, anyway. it wasn't crazy. Just believe us. Never. Well, Jake and Devin are looking inside the bathroom. Okay, Father Bryce? Okay. Good enough for me. Where is Chucky? I know he is somewhere in this bathroom. I can't see him anywhere. Oh, my God. <laughs> I got your phone, Jake. <laughs> Give me my phone! No! Not the phone! No! Curse you! What have you been taking pictures of? Let's see. Oh my god. What is this? Oh my god. What the heck? Oh my god. You are so terrible, Chucky. How dare you? Give me my phone back. I'm afraid not. Let me get this phone. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you! Stand back.
back, back, Jake. I will teach this Chucky a lesson. Uh, all right, Chucky. Now, tell me, how many Chucky dolls are there? I'm not telling you anything. Ah, oh, you spit in my face. Ah! <laughs> so long, suckers. <laughs> oh no. What are we going to do now? What are we going to do? I have no idea, but this has to be stopped. I hope this will. Oh no. No. Alright, gotta take out the birthday cake. Ha! Huh. I love birthdays, don't you? Oh, 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 that's the gate. Oh, Glenn and Glenda, they're here. The twins are here. The twins? Oh my god, it's happening. Oh my god, I finally waited all this moment to finally see what Glenn and Glenda look like. Oh, you're not gonna see what they look like. I will. So... I'm just going to put you back in the room. No, Tiffany. No, I don't want to go in the room. N well, you are going to stay in your room. <laughs> okay, Nika. Now you stay in your room. I don't want you to be nosy, nosy, nosy. <sighs> no, please. I want to see what Glenn and Glenda look like. Well, maybe eventually you will, but I got to see who they are. Oh, oh, they're here! Oh, yes, 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 yes. All right, I'm, I'm gonna go now. I'm, I'm going, I'm gonna go get Glenn and Glenda. I'm coming! I'm coming! Oh no! Coming! I'm coming! I'm coming! I'm coming! I am coming! I'm coming! All right, I'm gonna open the door. I can't wait to see what the twins look like. Hi, Glenn and Glenn. Oh my god, not you again. Hi, it's nice to see you again. So, uh, um, I'm, I'm sorry, Tiffany, but I'm still looking for Nika Pierce. I mean, you gotta be honest. Is Nika Pierce in your rich house? Uh, I don't, no, no, I don't think so. Come on, Tiffany. Lying is bad. Alright, fine. Yes, Nika Pierce is here. But she's innocent, I swear. That's not for us to decide, Tiffany. May I come in? Sure. Yeah, you can come in. Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright. Gotta shut the door. <sighs> Okay. Oh, I gotta admit, this house looks pretty good. Pretty rich. I know. Have you bought this house, Tiffany Valentine? Oh, yes, I bought it. How many years? One year ago. Huh, this house looks pretty rich. I wish I was living here, Tiffany. I mean, that would be cool. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's, it looks pretty good. I mean, I gotta admit, this looks like the best house that I've ever seen in the whole entire world. I know, right? So, uh... Yeah. Yeah. So, where is that Nika Pierce? Oh! <laughs> Wait, no, no, don't slit my throat! Don't! Oh! 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 for losers. <laughs> oh, God. Ugh, the twins, they're here. Oh, God. I see their car outside. Ooh. Oh.
Oh my. The twins are coming. I gotta hide this dead body. Ugh. Uh, gotta hide it. Ugh. Gotta hide it. Gotta get rid of this knife. Uh, uh, oh, God. Uh, 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 gotta get rid of the blood. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, my God. I see you guys. The twins are here. Glenn! Glenda! It's so nice to see your sweet faces. Ha, 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 ha.